Hello everyone and welcome back to Total War Medieval 2 as Scotland. When we'd left off we had claimed Hamburg and King oh, Edward the Crusader was back leading a massive army. We're soon to wipe Denmark off the map. Well not wipe them, just sort of uh, convince them all to absorb into our rapidly growing, dare I say, empire. But we'd left it off uh, roughly at the end of the turn here. We've got everything going that we need. We're not training any more units on the homeland currently. We just want to build up our economy there as much as we can. And we decided not to go for this battle right here. can't imagine how he's afforded all these mercenaries. I think mercenaries tend to be more expensive... Upkeep-wise, I guess 180 is not that expensive. Aye, but in any case, we'll just get right on to it with ending the turn there. France continuing to move things about. I think those are merchants, actually. That they're moving. Oh, England! come to beg for peace Lower are we at war with them? yes we are a noble lady approaches <laughs> yeah it is very generous you did attack us again regular tribute well, 10 turns i suppose this there is we go good day, i figured sir. they would accept that I'll not be going any further today. An explorer's guild available in, in Antwerp. Right there. Oh. I don't know that I'm keen on an explorer's guild. But that's mostly because I don't know what it does. Blockade Oslo for two turns. Aye, Captain. Oh, way up there. And there's a rebel Isn't army there. The fight you wish? Come closer. Oslo region and Stockholm region. Yes, yeah, so this is Stockholm. And then Oslo must be over there. And get fleet ready. Are you trying to give me an order? Engage me or be gone. Uh, Are you trying to yeah, give this me This fleet an will order? definitely take us out. Corsported captain. Gosh, they just have so many ships. Uh, oh, Moors and France are allies. We've declared a truce, yeah. Some militia trained around and some retraining. Yeah, we wanted to pop the militias up. Antwerp is upgraded and it is now a minor city. That's excellent news. Yeah, Antwerp the stone wall. And Hamburg has its port. Should increase its... Income decently. Robert Breschen, Beguiling Bard. Interesting. In Hamburg, we found a Holy Roman Emperor's Empire spy. Not Emperor, a Holy Roman Emperor. And we gained some money. Okay, so. Um. Huh? My question is, where did this army go that was just right here? Are you trying to give me an order? Have they just hidden somewhere? Yes, my king. No, if they were hiding around here, we'd see them, wouldn't we? At your service. They shall not see me, sire. Only twenty-two thousand. Again, I do want to upgrade it into a huge city, but. Google the Wrathful. I Lord. <sighs> These ballistas are so I slow can't. moving. Morgan Canmore ultimately. Obviously the uh, huge leader here. Great command. 
Aye, right. Well, first things first. Four units there. By your will, Why don't you go shall and do that? We shall hold them to siege, sire. Aye, sire. We may we them even siege. siege them out there. It's eight turns, which isn't too long. Or we might siege them out a bit and then attack. Just because it's a small force. I suppose we could send more people over, but I sort of don't want to. Who's... I think chivalry and piety are things that are important when it comes to uh, managing a town, governing. I was going to say all good and can more, but mentor, tutor. Yes, understands logistics. Well, he's a better commander than Ed, but... I think we're going to move him in there. I'll leave you because you're very low. We could retrain those 32. But we don't need to. Move. Uh, no, Algun is what we said, right? Yes, that increases the income a bit. We look at the rest of them. Yeah, they can Aye. just go right up to assault. Aye, my liege. So can they. My king, march. Battle will resolve our differences. Aye, my liege. My lord. Yeah, they've got almost a full Aye, my liege. half banner, so we'd have to drop half of these units be able to meet up with them. But do we need this many? Yeah, because I don't I don't want to go to war with France just yet. Here's what we'll do. We'll move them up right next to them now. So that way if this army comes across, they'll run right into Morgan Canmore and we can fight them all together. But then we'll leave we'll take half of this combined force and Besiege that, and the other half can go up that way. I can. Why don't we send those ships over as well? I feel like that's okay to do. Spain, just, just don't. Oh, they can probably sail around that way now. You don't seek any trouble, really. Why are you sailing people towards my shores? What are you doing? By trained in espionage. Yes, yeah, so that gives them one more base skill, but the quietly observant, that's not a, a great yes, sort of base. But whatever. Merchants at your service. Two more turns till the merchant gets On my there. Way. I will recruit one more boat. We'll make it just a, a, a cog. Another spy. I really want to get those going around the other side. Can't recruit any more merchants, correct? Yeah. We don't have any more around anywhere. We don't even have a priest here. Oh, but that's fine. Yeah, they're doing just fine. That one. Antwerp. Suppose the question is, yeah, we're building through most of the towns in there. Antwerp. What do we build here? Merchant's Wharf. Trading roads. Not trading, it's just paved roads. They're just roads. Let's build roads. Not as expensive. Oh, actually no, council chamber, chambers first. To increase the public order by a good bit so that we can bump the tax rate up some. then over here, oh yeah, they're building roads as well. Hmm. Aye, what do we want to recruit? Three archers there. And my three over there. Yeah, I do think we're a little short on archers. And I like the noble archers, but... Well, I don't know that we need more military right now. If we can be careful in the siege, 
if we siege them out for a few turns, they'll lose a lot there. Because once we take out that, then I think we're pretty set to take the rest of Denmark. Yeah, I, I don't know that we're gonna... Well, I guess, I guess we could trick out of the nobles. What the heck, we'll do one of each of those. Maybe one more boat just to have it over there. And... Training farms and things all over. church in Inverness, but we don't have it in Dublin. I don't think we need it. Um, yeah, I think that's all for us to train around right now. But well, we've got some merchants going Merchant places at down service. here, don't we? Merchant at your service. Why don't I... You're already slightly closer Merchant to down there. Service. So why don't you go there? I. Merchant at your you service. can go. On my way. Hopefully you'll be able to pass I'm through that night. Today. I've traveled as and far by as that I mean hopefully today, that sire. army will move and then we can pass through there. Oh, and the Explorer's Guild. Maybe I should say yes to this one. Does it, like, make our ships go farther or something? I don't know. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, maybe we'll take those off of there, and then we can say yes to it, just to have it. See if it does anything. Doesn't give us any special units or anything else, so... We will see. France? Do you have diplomatic offerings? Or are you trying to bribe me? I bring word from An alliance? Oh... Why is our reputation dubious? Everybody else attacks us? <laughs> huh. Well. I'm tempted to accept, because we don't want war with them, not just yet. And they've declared war on other things before. And they're also allies with the Papal States. I think we're going to say yes. Magnifique. Merci for accepting. Yeah. Bien. We shall speak again. Yeah. We'll be allies with France. No problems there. That's sort of one less front that we have to worry about. What? Um, who just blockaded the port there? Was that Russia? Did they declare war on us? And also, where did that army disappear to? And where has it come from now? Where was it hiding? Was it just like hidden in like those three trees? Uh, I should have known that that army didn't go anywhere. Well, obviously we don't want to fight that, so we're going to withdraw. Hope that they can't reach us. They can't reach us. Ooh, this is going to be probably bad. Clear defeat. Two ships sunk? Oh, come on. We shouldn't be losing that badly. Uh, well, there goes the entire fleet. Just like that, three hunks. No, no, we can't, we can't lose our bastion of chivalry. Edmund Canmore. The legend himself. Well, we got to go for it. All right. Let's see. Let's see if we can make some sort of miracle happen. If we can take out the army's general, they will be far more likely to break and run. I think that's kind of a desperate hope. But, you know, for, ooh, look at that. Is that like a watchtower? The back? Is this what, like, what fighting near a watchtower looks like? Or a little fort type thing? I wonder. So their reinforcements will be from over there. All right, let's go at them this way. Set those up. The 
enemy have brought up more men. They hope to make up in numbers what they lack in They the absolutely do hope to make it up in numbers, and they really have. Just wanted to see. Oh, yeah, the general's bodyguard is an even better charge and offensive unit than feudal knights. Very expensive upkeeps. Come on. We know you're going to attack us. Let's get on with it. General's bodyguard over in the back. If I move those off over there. Move you off over here. Our melee line is going to go down, fortunately. Oh, they're going to... They're going to try and take us out with the crossbows. Which totally makes sense, because we do not have a single ranged unit between us. And by between us, I mean among us. Not really a between to go off of there. No, don't... Ah! Crossbows are so good against armor. This is the worst possible. Don't stop running. I just told you to run in a different direction. No, no! Oh, they've taken down so many of our general's units. Crossbows are so good against heavily armored units. Why are you walking? Get up there, fight. The Highlanders are broken and routing? How? Your general is here. Fight on. You cowards. You hit those feudal knights pretty well. Oh, and on this side? Oh, how are you dying so fast? Frankish knights are shaken, but you've lost so many. These guys shooting at us? They don't even care about hitting their own men. This is a terrible, terrible loss. Half of our units are routing. Why don't the eight of you charge them? I'll you charge them. For defeat seems my lord. By the saints, <gasps> our men have slain the enemy oh. general. Without him, his troops will lose their will to Mid fight. fight while like running away, they somehow took out the enemy general. Too bad all of our forces are running. I don't understand why they're running so easy. I mean, I guess it's not easily, but normally when we've got a a general here, their units, like, never want to rout. Or, by their units, I mean our units. Viking Raiders. Get out of there! You charge in. You charge now. I'm going to let all their melee forces keep chasing us down there. Oh, come on. How can their general's bodyguard be wrecking us like this? I mean, you sh it should be the same stats. No. Okay. Aeon of Moray. Why is their general's bodyguard so much superior? We have one more attack. I guess it's just the superior numbers. They've absolutely smashed us. Oh, look, even my other knights charging in. They just fail. This one bodyguard unit has messed me up. No. I don't know where that unit is. Or why they're... Yeah, you're fighting. Kill them. 
This one bodyguard unit is the bane of my cavalry's existence. They've killed so many. Charged five feudal knights into them. We got a few, but we lost pretty much all of them. Yeah, no, they're just exactly the same as my bodyguard. I think we're going to concede defeat and hope that our general makes it out alive, but I can't imagine that he will. Lord preserve us. We have been dealt a stinging Oh my goodness. I should have sent off part of the main army to be with them. Especially when I didn't know where that big army went. I just kind of ignored it. I don't... What was I thinking? No, and they all died. No. <laughs> oh, this cannot be allowed to stand. Oh, the it Mongols invade. To comfortable with the enemy you know, our familiar foe. But to discount the menaces that lurk beyond the known world is to risk a rude awakening that can become a nightmare. This nightmare is the Mongol invasion. My goodness. The bulk of the Mongol forces have arrived not far from Baghdad, making it a dangerous place now. Oh, very far over there. New mission, cease hostilities with Denmark. Oh, come on. Right after they just attack and slaughter that army? I have half a mind to tell the Pope to stick it. I look forward to fighting my king. One I, ballista I, that way. I, my liege. My lord. Morgan Canmore and his army I, will go that way. I, my liege. I, move out. Combining the armies. I, my liege. We will leave this whole army right I, there. Sir. And they will be ready to take Ahas as, as soon as possible. We'll send this one over there. They shall not see me, sir. This one, our, our spy. And Russia's declared war at, on us. Like, Engage why? For, for what before. reason? I... What reason could they possibly have? All, just well, so that they could blockade our port there. I don't understand. They're not allies with anyone. They're not an enemies with anyone. We don't border them yet. I think they're, you know, they're off up here. And they just thought, you know what? Yeah, why not? War. Let's let's do it. War. Let's go. Like what? <laughs> okay, let's train another diplomat. We're going to send him off towards Russia and be like, "Hey, stop sieging us. Why are you doing that?" <laughs> London's a happy classic coming of age. Stefan Catmore. Noble death. Uh so sad. Extravagant, feels unappreciated, sensible drinker, religiously proper, can tell a tale, sociable. Alright, well, obviously Prince David there is... Why do we have him ruling a city? Such a good commander. Enter, refund... What is this? Why? Everyone leave me alone. Your forces melt away. Prisoner is executed. Prisoner is executed and then we're supposed to declare to just cease hostilities with them. Yeah. Unlikely. Okay, so we're building that there. Building. Still building. And Spain, oh, Spain, just give it up. Give it up. We'll send Stephen Canmore. I'm just going to say it's Stephen. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be pronounced, but... 
because I am Steven and it's very strange to say the name that weirdly. And we'll recruit two more because what the heck. It's a tiny force. I'm sure just five town militia behind the walls could defeat it fairly easily. But we'll send Stephen Canmore over and he's extravagant, which is really bad for a really bad for a governor. But uh, we'll see if maybe he can become a better governor by being there. And maybe he'll help defend it some. So if we're still building on all, all over, except in Nottingham, we don't really need to make anything else in Nottingham right now. We could do the crop rotation, but I'm not overly concerned. Then we will continue to build an army over here. And by continue, I mean start more readily building a large army over there. I, my liege. 23. Ah, you know, five turns, they might reach the 24,000 mark and then upgrade to a large city. I, my liege. Well, a huge city. There are, there are already a large city. Um, four hulks. We have three hulks, four cocks. You know what? I think we could probably just smash this Russian army. Okay, so we lost a cog, but we sunk two of their ships. It's a fine officer. You get out of here. Yeah, that gives us a lot more income from London, obviously, so... Retrain those. Oh, yeah. Retrain. Some noble Highland archers. Fleet ready. I, I captain. Yeah, we'll I'm actually move you out. Merchant at so I want service. you and you to go across. I, and didn't I, we recruit I, one more spy? My king. Uh, yeah, not as good, but another spy I nonetheless. Party. At your service. We'll keep yes, my king. the worst of the two. You can go over spy on Cam. At your service. English. You I want to move. No vantage point there, sire. Up they this way. There, sire. Stopping here, sire. Merchant you, you're just service. a merchant, right? An eighty three. We'll head you down As there. You say, sire, merchant at your service. Yes, you On get to way. there. Merchant at your service. Actually, you. As you say, sire. Oh, we are not oh that merchant's going to gonna buy you out. Enemies. Almost certainly. I, I've traveled so, as far as I can, we'll just move off to the side, hope that he goes back to where he was, <laughs> and ignores I'll us. We we'll move you up there. Not even the royal. Merchant at your service. 10, 21, 10. Gosh, nothing's nearly as good as that mine. Oh, yeah, you can go down there. We'll leave that merchant where he is. Need a bigger merchant to buy him out. Okay. So now that we're spending loads of money. My liege, you will have to fight us for this war, my lord. Loot some mercenaries, but I don't really feel the need Aye, to. My liege. Can't construct a fort or watchtower there, but I could construct one right there. I can't. I can only sort of remember what forts do. I think it just like puts you in a little defensive spot that they have to siege out, or like create siege weaponry for and siege. Yeah, London and Edinburgh, not too happy. London should be happier once that's done, though. And once the crop rotation's done, we'll build a city hall there as well. 
Gosh, they're really not growing a whole lot more. All right. This is this kind of a lot of gold to leave left over, though. But but there's not much else for us to. Uh... Oh, you know what? There sure there sure is. Uh, and unfortunately, it's spending everything we have on cogs to have military, uh, naval military power. France, our allies. Why don't you just continue your war with the Holy Roman Empire and keep them busy so that we don't go to war with the Holy Roman Empire? Oh, that spy's in there. I don't like that. I'm hoping that army's going to move through and attack Bruges. Oh, yes, yes. Move back into Frank again. Well, no, but just stop walking through our land. Spain! I don't understand what could possibly be going through the AI right now. Like, every few turns, they go to war with us. They go to war with us, they siege the city, we smash an army of theirs, and then they we go to ask for peace, and they are desperate for peace because we're so much stronger than them. Whoa, a new crusade has been called. The Holy Bible may preach against Tunis. <sighs> so far away again. I don't know why it's got you all highlighted, but yeah, go, go do something over there. There wasn't a merchant there. Perfect. Cardinal report. Oh, we've got a cardinal now. Excellent. Papal States Cardinal died, and we were put in. Spain's declared war on us, obviously. York, Carnarvon, and London. All finished those. Aid Canmore. Fair in rule. I don't know which one. Ah, oh, yes. You. Lovely. End of turn report. We lost a ton of money, probably because Carnarvon being sieged definitely hasn't helped. Look at how our incomes dropped. Oh, weren't we getting a ton of money from Spain, too? You, can you move to that, that spot? There we go. And you still can't see what they have. Good lord. Fleet ready. We will not surrender these waters easily. We sunk all three, and we lost. We did lose a Hulk for it. But we sunk all three of their ships. Excellent. The Russian Navy's there, doing nothing, because why on earth would they? Why would they be fighting us? It's our diplomat, Lulach of West Lothian. Make your way over to wherever Russia is. Our leader must join the crusade. King Edward the Crusader. Aye, my liege. Aye, my liege. But I can't make just King Edward do it, because he has too few units. Oh, man. You know what we're going to do? We're going to march him down and make a, a spear militia army. No, we'll just do town militia, because why not? We'll call it a, a, a town militia crusading army. And then we could just recruit crusading units while he's on the way down there, because they're so much cheaper than normal units. Aye. So, King Aye, Edward, the Crusader, back on the Crusades. Dongart Canmore. He's quite a decent general as well. Dougal the Wrathful is there. I am not here oh, they've split up the defense. army some. Interesting. An enemy to crush. 
Well, I don't want to split our forces up too much. Oh wait, no. Why do you have both ballistas? There's no reason for that. Let's march you over, and let's just say that we split these armies in half. One, two, three. My king. Four. My king. I. Three. My king. I lord. And then you take both of those. Now that's not really in half at all. <laughs> However, we have more units training. So that's a pretty solid army. Five good infantry units, four decent, three decent archers, one good archer, and a few cavalry. Could use a few more cavalry, but we will get there. You, you, can't retrain the Highland archers yet. Once that's done, we might build an archery range, just so we can get the noble. Or do we want Highland pikemen? I think I want the pikemen. They're terrible defense. But the attack is so high. But the thing is, pikes are really strong. Like, spear units that can form spear wall are very good defensively. And really, in essence, our army can be made up of pikes to hold a defensive line and a ton of archers and cavalry. Okay, I think we're going to... Hmm... Well, let's just see here. Where were you going? Oh, you were going over this way. I am a commander, noble Van Armored sergeants and ballista. That's a it's a hefty army. You shall not see me, sire. Just passing through, mon ami, at your service. You were going over to Can on my way to see what's up with England. Not a lot. They've got nothing. Next time they sail a few units across at us we're just gonna sail back across and wipe them out of the game especially the, the only reason we didn't before is because we didn't want to kind of uh oak france and have a unit there in the center at of your service on my way stopping here oh yeah there's the border Sire, between stockholm region and oslo's over there Okay. I my king. We will not rest until you relent. I know your enemy. It is me. So I my Edward will go back. These will train a few more and kind of buff up Where's that army. When it's at this point, I think it's good enough. See with this many units, I think we could beat one of their full banner stacks. Well, maybe if we had just a little bit more cavalry. I think we could beat a full You're banner army. Here. Negotiate the truth. Like two more cavalry, no, and we could enemy. beat a full banner army. So this is pretty much good. I just like you know, oh well, they've got four cavalry. One or two more might oh. not hurt. But we'll just build them up to like sort of three quarters strength first, and then we'll see. But first things first, we are going to attack the Spanish destroy that army, and then hopefully sue for peace again now that we've smashed their navy and the army. Then we'll attack over there. Oh no, we can't attack them yet. Because we'll be excommunicated. Oh, and our things also blockade that port. It's okay, it's okay. We'll just attack Spain, try and get peace with them again. But uh, that is going to have to wait for the next episode. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.